So tonight's video is a real stab in the dark. I'm going to try UV paint and UV light for the first time. So we bought this UV light, super cheap for about £10. And I've never actually done any proper UV photography, so I thought I'd give it a go because all these lockdown blogs are about doing stuff that I've never done before. And we thought we'd put some really cool still lives together for like minerals and plants and all the things that the internet says should fluoresce under UV light. So we tried a number of different objects under the UV light. Some things worked as expected and some things were underwhelming. The chlorophyll in the plant gave a really cool fluorescent red, but nothing really stuck out. So we abandoned the idea of doing a still life with what we had in the flat and we picked up some UV makeup instead. I applied the UV paint with a toothbrush to flick it over her face and give that universe look, which looked pretty cool. The challenges associated with UV photography are those associated with low light photography. If you don't have much light, you need to make compromises. You need to either open the iris, which will give you a lower depth of acceptable focus, go for a slower shutter speed, which will give you motion blur, so a tripod becomes essential, or you have to up the ISO, which will make your image noisier. The skill is to be able to balance your ISO stop and shutter speed to give you the least worst result. Having a modern digital camera that can go to very high ISOs without much noise does rather take a lot of the skill out of it though. So yeah, that was a lot of fun, but what did we learn from it? Well, I'm loath to say this, but actually when you're doing really low light photography, your gear actually does count. If you've got a camera that can go quite smoothly up to three, four, five thousand ISO without too much noise, you can have a much easier time of it than if you don't. I had a lot of fun. I think we got some cool results. If you like these videos, like, share, subscribe, all that kind of stuff. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.